Scene.com. Thanks for joining me for another video beer review. This time we've got a can of beer from More Beer Company in Bristol. It's kind of their TFA, as you can see on there. Totally fucking awesome. <laughs> it's 7% ABV, black IPA. Great. I mean, um, their DAC alliances I mean, are, are very nice. I mean, um, nicely made kind of dark beer. And uh, they do a lowish ABV. Um, oh, that smells amazing. It's jumping out at me. Um, a lowish ABV um, black IPA, which I've had before. I can't remember if I've made what it's called. So when this uh, appeared at my local bottle shop, I stumbled down for a minute. So local bottle shop. It's can beer shop. I thought uh, I went and got it straight away because I knew it. Um, this thing. I mean, they're clearly very excited about it. It's called totally fucking awesome. How I hope it is. I can smell it from here. It smells amazing. But so beer in the glass, very very dark. I mean, absolutely pitch black. Um, I'd say it's stout dark. It's opaque head, really creamy kind of head on that. So let's give it a swirl and sniff. Check out the aroma. That's lovely. Loads of lemon and lime. Really kind of sherbet lime. Oh, that's lovely. Definitely getting some of that kind of more black currant and blueberry. Where that the way it's kind of where hops and malt meet. And you're getting a very small amount of kind of licorice and kind of sarsaparilla kind of thing. But it's all about kind of sharp citrus. Smells great. Let's dive in. Can't wait to try it. Cheers. Oh, that's magnificent. Oh, that's lovely. I, I like black IPA. And when I poured it, kind of with, with that creamy head and the dangness of it, it kind of sprung to mind memories of um, um, Stone's um, Sublime Self Righteous, which they no longer make. Probably one of my, you know, while I'm making it, one of my top five beers. I mean, I got it once in a while, but I love that beer. And this is definitely along those lines. Big punchy hop character. Definitely lots of sharp citrus. Once again, it's lemon and lime, grapefruit, bitter orange. A lot more grapefruit on the, on the flavour than on the aroma. A nice backbone. Once again, it's kind of like it's it's blackcurrant and sarsaparilla. Maybe hint of coffee, like filt um, like a black filter coffee. but not too much, it's kind of berry and things like that. Which brings the, the, that kind of malt flavour. Just because there's so much hops going on in it, it it's knocking off any kind of chocolate and um, coffee and things like that really. Keeping that to a minimum. Hint of smoke. Actually a bit of chocolate there. It's, a, it's, it's relatively complex, it's a big punchy flavour and beer, I mean it's absolutely stunning. Mm -mm. I've had some really nice beers from more. So since they they've launched their cans, I say this is the best one they produce. That's lovely stuff. So that is a can of TFA. Totally fucking awesome. To be honest, it is. <laughs> Black IPA, seven percent ABV from More Beer Company in Bristol. Lovely stuff. I'm Rob from Hobbsy.com, and I'll see you next time. Cheers.